this is Cheryl and I'm back with another um, process video for you. Uh, I am scrapping a photo of my daughter as she was home from university on break at Christmas and uh, we were just enjoying a day of downtime. You know how the holidays are, they're crazy and busy and so it was nice to just kind of sit around. I think we had been watching some, you know, just TV and talking and playing on our phones and reading. And of course, uh, our cat likes to come sit in our laps and she misses Olivia when she's gone. And she had decided to take up um, residence with her while she sat there. For a while it was just so cute I had to take the picture they just looked it was like a happy comfy let's just stay in our PJs kind of day so I'm trying to decide what kit I want to use and I think I'm going to use um, one I've had for a while um, from Sweet Shop Designs, and it's um, Shauna Klingerman and Erica Zane. So, uh, yeah, I think, yeah, like, I mean, that's cute. It's a snuggle kind of day. And it's like the perfect little start here. Get a little string going on. I can't say that we drank hot cocoa that day. I may have. I don't remember. But at any rate. This kit is just adorable. I've been scrapping with just a lot of cute stuff lately. All right, now I have to decide on the background paper. Hmm. Let's see. Kind of like, I'm a sucker for ledger and graph paper, all that kind of stuff. But I've also really liked plaids and um, I've enjoyed matting them as well. I like the softness of that. Gonna add some paint. Put the sides down a little bit. And I am gonna bring the sides down on this as well a little bit. Kind of want it in keeping with that piece of word art in there. Get 
the stitching up here. quite a bit. Yes, yes, indeed. Make sure that's next to each other. I like that quite a bit. I'm gonna try this newsprint stand up to see how that looks. Decrease the size of these washi tapes just a tad. Hmm. Let's see what else I can find. Got some flowers. And like this little resin flower. I'm going to decrease the size of this quite a bit, I think. Just layer it right on the top there.
I think I'm down to my last few things I want to add. I'm sorry, I'm getting quiet tonight. I can just put, um, I can make that a little bit smaller, and I'll just put it actually, I'm going to move that there in between these two, pull it under that stitching. think I'm going to move all of this over to this side. And maybe rotate a little bit. Yeah. Just a tad. Okay. All right. I'm going to call it done. I'm going to add my journaling um, off camera and you'll see the finished layout coming up. If you uh, enjoyed watching the video, give me a thumbs up, a like, and be sure to share it with your other friends who enjoy watching process videos. And of course, subscribe so you don't miss when I add new videos, which I'm on scrap and roll lately. So, um, yeah, I'll be adding um, at least one or two every few days. All right, I will see you in the next video. Thanks again for watching.